Owls and cats are a bit alike. Wait, owls and cats are a bit alike. They wanted hair and blood from a black cat. Can I get hair and blood from the owl and mess with the recipe? No. No, I cannot. Oh. Okay, we can play music. I wonder if that changes anything in the house? It's only- you can only hear it in that room. Until you leave. I guess no blood in that alley more. Yeah, I didn't know if that was a live owl or if it was supposed to be like a taxidermied one. I guess it's the latter. Hmm. Monster who likes goats. Sisters look alike. Red rose and painting. Lock the attic. If I take the pills, I'm just gonna fall down the well again. Very old painting. What is that monster? So much blood. A mirror, but why isn't my reflection there? You never know with point and click adventures, especially this one could be stuffed, and that is probably where you get the blood anyway. Yeah, I I don't know. Like, for example, like th this guy's got the stomach acid, right? I feel like I could just like splash water on it to dilute it, but you can't do that. Or the baking soda, but you can't do that. Or get the cauldron of water and bring it in here, dump that on it, but you can't do that. So, those are the obvious solutions in my mind, but those aren't it. So I don't know what it wants. Can't touch the bottle, it really burns. Mm, clues allowed. Um, usually I say no, but I feel like we've been stuck on this one for a while, so if you want to give me something small to go on, I'll take it. But I appreciate you asking first, because uh, I usually don't want people to help if I haven't had enough time to work on something. Typewriter, and it works. I could write something. A good writer has to know what to write about. Oh, wait, 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 can we edit this? I could write something, but what? I could write something, but there isn't any paper. And a good writer has to know what to write about first. Okay, so we could use the typewriter to maybe edit the recipe and mess with it, but we need paper. Second floor, table. The drawer is empty. White candles everywhere. Oh, what's this? Tweezers to pick up stuff that tiny hands can't. <sighs> what did I need to pick up that was small? Uh, wait, wait, the, the thing in the well? Revealing the true soul. The world hides the truth from you. Work your soul through life and you will understand the purpose of this act. If you try to corrupt this essence, your soul will be hidden and never see the face of truth. To destroy an impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped, you will need blood from the execu executor of the ritual, five black candles, ashes to form a pentagram, a blue-bloomed moonlight rose, salt and pepper, hair from the person you want to bewitch. Draw a pentagram with the ashes inside the black and white square. Put a lighted black candle on every point of the pentagram. Fill a cauldron with water and put the other elements in it. Boil. Pour over the person you want to bewitch and repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. Uh, Bont ir arkin o ir begma o iburi namaburi og bonti ir ekaran o ir begma. Hofme mon dime gofmia ibere eg itius ernemi bomeg bu ibarim isni. Oh! Uh, 
to destroy an impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped. Is that like the two girls with the trapped bodies? The frog died. It's not good to eat bottles. Okay, there's that. Uh, blood from the executor of the ritual. That's me. Hair from the person you want to bewitch. Um, does she have a hairbrush upstairs or something? I assume we're trying to bewitch the twins. I could write on this recipe, but I need it just as it is. Oh, I just put the old recipe in there. Oh, are we going to make the old recipe have the instructions of the new one? Hair from your... <laughs> it's so obvious! <laughs> what should I do? Okay. Alright, so... There we go. So now we've got that. Hi. Thank you. Alright, so now we've got the recipe that says we need hair from their head. This is like... Hang on a second. This is like the 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 old thing where if uh, if somebody has a paper from school and it says like you know you you get an F, and then they get home and they're with like a different colored pen, they're like, yeah, mom and dad, I got an A, <laughs> and it's like not even the same color. Oh man, I nailed it. Uh, okay, all right, so. When the girls come back, I show them this, I guess. I gotta fool them. Oh, perfect timing. Fran, here are the materials you'll need if you studied the ritual. Yes, but I need more time. I can't remember all the words. Well, learn them fast. Let us know when you're ready. Girl, I think you need help getting rid of that bag. I can do it for you. I may need it. You don't trust me. If we want to get out of here, that bag must disappear. I'll take it. You didn't see me. Bye. Did you find a solution already? Bye. Alright, can we go show her the recipe and try to trick her now? Look, ladies, there's something missing. I couldn't find your hair in the bag. Hair, you say? No hair is needed. We know that. But look for yourself. It's written down there in the recipe. That's true. How could we miss that? All right. And now, get prepared. I'll let you know when I'm ready. <laughs> your face. All right. Um... Draw a pentagram, put a line to black candle, fill the cauldron water, and put the other elements. Okay, the other elements is the rose, salt, and pepper, and the hair. Goodbye, blue rose, into the pot now. Salt and pepper, into the magic soup. Now the hair, good. Blood from the executive. Oh, I'm gonna have to use the knife on myself. Ah! Use Fran's blood. There goes my blood. I hope it tastes good. Tra la la. I 
I made the most incredible magic potion in the world. All right. Draw a pentagram of the ashes inside. Put a lighted black candle every quarter full of cauldron. Pour over the person you want to bewitch and repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. Um. Do I need to get them to come to the pentagram? Or do I just dump it on their head right now? We're waiting for you, Fran. Everything is ready. Let's go to the kitchen. Good, let's go. And what is this going to do again? Revealing the true soul. Please sit down and close your eyes, ladies. Hold on. Just in case it's going to ask me what the magic words are. Bonti ear arkin o ear begma. Alright. And now I'll say the words. Bonti ear arkin o ear begma o ibari nami ibari erg bontidi er ekron. Ba weep gra na weep ninny bon. Ba weep gra na weep ninny bon. That isn't the right spell. He tricked us. Get mucked, ladies! Wow. When it said it was going to reveal the true soul, I didn't think it was just going to kill him. What have I done? Oh my goodness, this isn't right. Yoink. The key. Now I can free my kitty. If he's still alive out there. Yeah, one of the things was like blood from a cat. I'm wondering if they already killed him. Oh, good. He's still moving. What is it, Fran? Open the cage. I can't. The key doesn't fit. Did you see another keyhole somewhere? Yes, I saw one. I'll see if it fits there. I'll be waiting. Hurry up. Did I see another keyhole? Another keyhole. I... Hmm. Talk to the frog. Did you find a solution? Hmm. Need a hint? No, no, no. I just started on this one. Hang on. Golden key. I wonder if this will open the cage. No. What you eating? Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Drawer is empty. Pretty doll. I like the hairstyle. I like my own dress, but those are pretty too. A dusty mirror and some other things. Toys in the attic always carry sadness with them. It's very understandable. Hint is in the bedroom. Oh, at the top of the mirror? What? A mechanical thing, it rotates. Maybe some sort of engine. Oh, okay.
This must be part of the machine. I can't move it. Hmm. Why is it Bioshock hacking? Great, there's dead people in the mirror. Awesome. What is this? Two skeletons. They look kind of small, like me. I can't imagine who these two were. Then I'm not a killer. Oh, I can't imagine. Oh, she's saying those are the twins? Um... Sister Promise. We, Clara, and Mia Beholmet promise to revenge the unfair destiny Edward decided for us. With blood and tears, we promise that we will kill him and bring our bodies back. We won't stand this any longer. Even though we are sisters, we hate each other, and we will always hate each other. Nothing will ever change that. But now with our bodies attached to each other, we can't complete our task. The strongest will live forever, and the weakest will die. What the sh Oh dear, this must be the key to the cage, finally. Mother must die. Ooh. Duotine? My pills are called Duotine too. Okie dokie! Uh, I think this is the key. It worked, my dear kitty. It worked. Come out. Let me hug you. Aww. Yay! We beat the game. Awesome. This feels so good. I'm free, friend. My good friend. Time to go home. Yes, let's go. the frog we murdered the lady. I did it, Sir Toad. The girls are gone. That's perfect. Now I can leave this place and return to my family. I want to do that too, sir. I finally found my kitty. I just want to go home now and be with Aunt Grace. How will you get out of here? There's no boat. I thought you could help us get out of here. I would love to help you, but I'm too tiny. Even though my body is quite malleable, it would be impossible to carry you both to the other side. Let me think about it. Don't leave us yet, please. Uh... A sealed bicycle in the middle of an island. My sister's trying to catch me, but I ran away. I come back here, and there's no cat. Ah. <sighs> Look, kitty, this is where I killed two people. <laughs> <coughs> I won't lay down in that thing. I'm thinking we have to make something that floats for the toad to pull us or something? Not sure.
there anything else in here? The sisters have a huge scar in the middle. A pink rosette, pretty hair decoration. A two-headed doll, it must be really old. Duotine. A blue rosette, I like it very much. Hmm. Fox. Coin. Scorpion. Oh, it's not a two-headed baby anymore. Oh, a sleepy doll. You don't want to, huh? That's okay. I can sing for myself. <coughs> okay. Well, it's not the creepy baby anymore. Talk to him again. I did it. The girls are gone. I can return. No boat. Uh, I can't swim. Mr. Midnight is so afraid of water. I'd love to help you, but I'm too tiny, even though my body is quite malleable. It'd be impossible to carry you both. Let me think about it. Don't leave us yet, please. Big rock. I'll leave it there. Don't think it would take me very far. Big rock. I'm scared, would you help me? I have a monster inside my head. I still have this recipe. I'm trying to think how the frog would get us across the water. I was like, imagining if we had like a raft and it would pull us, or if we could shrink down somehow. He mentioned he was malleable. I don't know if we're supposed to, like, kill him and wear his body as a suit or some crazy crap. I really hope so. I don't want to kill the frog. Died, it's not good to eat bottles. Mr. Mecca back from McDonald's. You found Mr. Midnight. Uh, we think we did, but we only see him when we're not on drugs, so who knows, actually. Can we climb the rope? Doesn't seem like it. I hope this does not work. I won't even try that. Okay. I'm kind of glad that that wasn't the solution. Uh, the plank from the well? No, it was one use. I can't pick it back up. We need to get home, Kitty. I hope the way back isn't far. I hope so too, Fran. We can do this together. I can help you. Take this toad, it may help. I'm not a bakery bun, but you're all slimy and soft like dough. You're right, it may work, you're good. Are you serious? Baking soda was the answer? Dude, I was just, that was a Hail Mary. It worked, it really did. I'm so big and I feel gorgeous. Great, let's go, Mr. Midnight. Sure, Fran, I only have one complaint. That giant toad is staring at me. He wants to help. What are you talking about? He wants to help us, that's all. All right, if he tries anything, I'll scratch him. It's okay, but try not to hurt him too much while we're sitting on him. The water is deep, and we don't know what kind of creatures are in there. If we fall in the water, we can die, Kitty. I promise I won't scratch the toad. Let's go. And girl, before we go, I forgot to give you something. I saw you in this picture, so I thought it was yours. Hey! And this book was with it, too. Leon. Toad, you found my family photo. Thank you very much. I thought I'd lost it forever, but the book isn't mine. 
We'll take the book as a gift. It's always healthy to read. It has many pictures. Thank you. I like pictures. Let's go now. Yes, here we go. Hold on tight. Blah! <laughs> Wait, are we gonna play Frogger? Oh my god. <laughs> we died. First try. Here we are. Jump off me now. Let's go, kitty. Well, now it's time to go home. I hope you find your family soon, Mr. To Sir Toad. Thank you. You too. Farewell. Goodbye, sir. Thank you for the ride. Fran, what should we do now? Find the way back home, Kitty. Did you see the sky? It's dawn, and really soon all the scary things will disappear. Ah, I'm so hungry and sleepy. I want to go home now. Me too, Kitty. We'll find the way. I'll do my best to help you, my dear. Let's go. Oh dear, a baby skeleton. I guess they didn't make it in time. Sir, are you the curious insects that get stuck? They're sleeping. Maybe they're not stuck. I hope they have their hair comb. This bridge looks pretty scary. Fran, come on. We have to get home. There's no time to be afraid now. Yes, but I'm a bit afraid of heights. Um, I can go first, all right? Then you follow me. All right, kitty. You're so sweet. I'll be right behind you. Fran, wait. Oh, no! No! The weight limit! Oh, my gosh. Oh, my dear. I can't hold on anymore. I don't want to die. You won't die, my friend. Come on. You can do it. Jump. All right. Here I go. I got you. Fran, no! <laughs> the cat. I got you. Ah! He jumps too. <laughs> Don't be afraid, fam. We always fall. After the pain, we will always rise. Is that her aunt? Oh, dear Aunt Grace, don't ever leave me. Don't cry, my little girl. Your heart is pure, but your mind is tormented. You have to stay and walk your own path. Please, Aunt Grace, why won't you just take me out of here, please? 